Start with Nicole Brock Estrup. This at the sixth for a birdie. Long range here, Morgan. Yeah, up and over a huge ridge, but this is a great way to get started on your front nine. Yeah, that will get them to 15 under par, two back. She's playing alongside her fellow countrywoman, Nana Kurtz Madsen. This is Heiji Kang at the fifth. I tried to get underneath that with the lob wedge of some sort. Did it ever work out nicely? Not for long, though. It's at the seventh, Titakun with the team moved forward. Watch it. It wasn't far away from going in. That would. And how about Kupcho at the seven? And that would get the pair to 17 under par. And they're currently. And this is Ali Ewing second at the eighth. That was a big iron there. You could see her right by the 200 yard marker. And we'll go out to the eighth. Great to have you with us, uh, Morgan. And this is going to be a lot of fun today. Yeah, it's an exciting day with this format. Lots of birdies to be made, even with the conditions a little bit tougher. Still kind of a go for broke mentality in this format. What a beautiful shot there by IK. Lexi Thompson playing with Brooke Henderson. Second at the 15th. There's a beautiful crowd out watching, full crowd out watching this pair. No surprise, Tom. Oh, yeah, and they'll be delighted with that. From Tirakun, this is her third shot coming back down the green. That's, yeah, pretty fast back down that green, Morgan. 12th, the oh, T. He's moved up today. He's only playing 248 yards. Oh, yes. Impressive from Amelia Lewis. So that gets... Very excited fans out there, Tom. Yeah, they're starting to come alive. They're still early. Now, Cupcho out of the bunker at eight. Yeah, just trying to maybe hole it out or at least get it up there close, but... Probably six feet for par left than yesterday, and the wind is up out of a different direction, out of the north. Heiji got all the green to deal with here. Well, exactly. And Morgan, yeah, you're exactly right. Friday was overcast, no wind. You could really control the ball. Today, cooler temps. Looks like she was making some fade type practice swings there, okay, to try and get the ball to stop a little quicker out of this rough. Ah, but she got underneath it too much. A bit of a risk, Kay, taking it up the right, but it has paid off. She has a perfect angle. She lost this a little uh, right. Left. She did. Lucky she caught it enough to get it on to the edge of the green. So Ty Titikun at 10. Just driven it left in that rough. Straight away hole this. 10 and 11 run next to each other, two different directions. Yeah, 152 yards to the hole. Hitting a little cut shot, low, low controlled cut. Very nice. Yeah. Well, indeed, looking to try and make a very nice check here. IK Kim, nice touch. Good performance from those two players who don't have a lot of experience playing on the LPGA Tour and to, uh, to post the scores they have has been really good because she's trying to earn as many CME points as she possibly can. She's not ranked right now on the LPGA Tour. Austin Kim at the 12th, how about that? since they've had a birdie. Last one came at the fifth. A couple paces ahead of where Ali Ewing hit. A little too much of a pull there. EG has not been striking the ball. Can't see the surface of the green. 
Wind slightly hurting right to left mostly. At the 15th, and a tie it to Dekun is ready to play. And this is a tough par three, 190 yards, whole location all the way in the back left today. It is downwind. Conditions have changed on this golf course. What a shot. Jennifer not solely able to focus and dwell on the negative, having Allie there to really help lift her up and vice versa at times. We all get into that little bit of a rut. Over to 15. This is Georgia Hall, English pair, along with Charlie Hull. They're good friends. They've been friends since junior golf. I actually expect, expected them to challenge a bit more. How about that approach? Sort of a little modified chip and run, and that's got way too much speed. Not really the chip you want to have your partner watch. Back at 14, this is the second for Yin. Take dead aim. Roning's not 100% healthy at the moment, struggling with a little bit of a wrist injury. Kind of a little bit under it with her right shoulder. Let's see Allie set up much more squarely here with her feet. Almost right at the flag stick. And she gets a wonderful kick and continues to feed closer to the hole. Back to the 15th. And this is running in second. Struggling with a wrist injury. Maybe some roots down there, but came out okay. Um, just a Terrain is sloping wildly left to right. Her partner has hit it up about four feet for par <laughs> and that was that was about as good as she could do if it didn't go in first by ali ewing downhill oh. two in a row <laughs> clutch putt by ali ewing putter coming alive down the stretch that's just what you want up at the 16th, this is the second for Denmark's Nicole Brock Estrup. I have to feel like these teams really have to birdie out. Go ahead and fly it at the flag stick. Even a little beyond is okay. Allie going with a little bit more of a three quarter shot. Jen went with a big full swing, which is going to have a lot more spin. Much better control there from Ali Ewing. And that's when it's nice to have a partner to fail you out. Yeah. All in all, it didn't end up in that disastrous a spot. Pretty straightforward chip from there. This is Nana Coach Madsen. They still have an outside chance. They could have birdied the last two. Yeah, what's that number? Ronin Yin. Now, this group has been funny. You think about team names and things like that. When Antaya was asked about who made the decision, she said Ronin made everything. Ronin's the one who made our dinner reservations. Channel your inner Bryson. Well, that came out a little heavy, Morgan, but had enough release to get so uh, that's going to be written. She could move inside the top 100 potentially with those points in the new list tomorrow. That's Tidakun's second on the way. Yeah. It's tough to get it close to that hole coming out of the rough today. It's on a little bit of a crown in the middle of that green. Such a challenging shot. That ball wants to shoot left off a lie like that. And See if Ataya can dial it in. Yes! In her Dow Championship tournament debut, she has a chance to win. Go out to the 17th. Heiji Kang for a birdie. Well, it's probably a little... Too, little 
too late for this team. Her partner, I.K. Kim, will make five at best.